Down the hatches on the defense. Early util and Fresh early ready. aggression, Chadney. Sanji's gone before he can fire a bullet. He's lost his util. Yekinder's not willing to swing, but Stewie is. And he's already taken another head. Hello. They are bringing the pain train straight into the VP station. Dropping back as well now. They're two quick openings. And Team Liquid, they've rejigged over towards long. They're taking territory back. Very proactive stuff. Ooh, no fun for Jame there. I think he backs away. Thinks better of it. They back up. Double up in pit. It's a luxury they can afford given the man disadvantage. And they want to punish quick here. They know that if they strike now, it's just the B defenders. Chad, they've isolated this. If they can just win this duel, it's Glocks though. And they've closed the gap. Missed shots from Stewie, give them a way back in. Fallen wants to show them out. Buster's gone. Naf catching some flag from Kickit. Tons, and it is down to Jame not to be today. Just kick it. And so Team Liquid, without a single body dropped, can they have the perfect pistol? Kick it is very, very low here. 23 points of health, has to make some sound cues. He even gets up towards short. He can get the plant here. Nah, nah, nah. This is the best out of a bad situation. It's an open runway run? right now. I think Fallen surely got the punish here. If he plants safe, he should be able to get away with this. Oh, lordy. He's managed. Go on, jump. Oh, he's Just actually in time. got it. Extra 800 for everyone involved. Just some simple nades set up towards this B bomb site, towards back of plat. It is going to be NAF again. The org, the scope at this range should be able to mow them all down. Five members in tunnels. Nade comes through. They're going to use the smoke of it. NAF spams on down. Oh, oh, it hurts. The meat grinder unloads and two bodies hit the deck. It's into the heads. James desperately hoping for a P250, a stray bullet. And these pistols from VP now just whittling down any utility they can. They should group up, see if they can find a kill. All the stuff here. Naf's gone down, but eh, it's not too many dramas. They'll be able to pick that one up. <laughs> Surely VP don't grab another plant. You'd assume so. Looks like Fallen's confirmed our suspicions. All right. Guarantee I'm not so sold here, especially as James steps up to the plate. Oh, that's good damage. He steps out into the open and Buster's quick to punish. Elise sprinting from his boosted position and there's your kinder. 27, still in the chamber. He is set for success and it will be Liquid just locked out. No one's making any sound cues either, so we will see everyone bringing all their goodies in. Yakinda's getting a little inquisitive, but nobody firing another bullet. Yeah, they've been able to get cat control right now and Utility hasn't been thrown out willy-nilly from Liquid just yet, so they'll have a bit to deal with this game taking space. What a shot! Fallen! Oh, oh, and a second added to the tally. The, ledge. the bomb just dropped down onto elevator. Oh, that gets really awkward. You're right, Kickit's already been the hero with two sensational shots. Nav catching Sanji, there's enough time now. Kickit's had to drop down. Stewie, this could be everything. His life is now gone. Bomb thrown up, Jame to plant. Saved by Kickit, not only in the frags, but saving the bomb as well. Doable uh, now. They yeah. might consider this. Grim yet to really have any impact. He was long this entire time. Now returns from Cat. And a full set of util for Nav on the way back in. Kick its position. Doesn't have the most impact if they lose Jame. His life. Very valuable. Good util usage. Gives him time to walk on in. Jame, though, has isolated Nav. Grim advancing. Needs a chance. He does just see the jiggle. James so elusive. He does Six find it. him. If he holds it, it's down to kick its jump. And Might he have it. The spray. Grim steals it from under their noses. He'll take the frag, maybe even the orb. That is golden stuff from Grim. Huge play right there. Two mollies towards the ramp. A flash set for his teammate. It holds them at bay. Grim got caught as well. A second. Elige backs up to ramp. There's three here to receive them. Needs a precision and Grim's struggling. Oh. Yakinda isn't. Back onto the site with a first frag. Bombs on his way, courtesy of Sanji. Jame onto Stu. Awkward if Elige doesn't find anything. Can Yakinda make sure of it? And that seals the deal. Jame fills the feed for a final. Yeah, great stuff there from VP. Jame was just in charge of covering that B rotation, making sure they couldn't get over and help those A defenders. And that lack of utility on Naf and Stewie will come into play. Oh my golly what gosh. What was that from your kinder? And he's got some pep in his step. He keeps sw swinging wide into the site. Elise tucked on Goose. It's down to Grim to help him. No way. Finally goes down before any more damage can be inflicted. Great supportive flash from Grim. Isolates these a little. Kick it overwhelms. And all over the shop, liquids start to drop. Only two remain already. Stewie's well aware that Buster late on the tons. I think he spotted him. Oh, Buster clean as well. What is going on? These VP gentlemen are squeaky clean.
Just so sharp here, and Grim can't get away with the Famous. On short, falls off after initial scary shots, and this is going to be the B execute. Double flashes, Dewey's lost his util. Naf does find one with his P250. Overwhelmed now, two into the side from the CTs. Grim can't help because Sanji's just popping heads. Look how glorious it looks. That's some problems if Sanji's popping off like that. VP might be running Those away with a Those were his first three here. frags of the game, and they were so swift. Keeping it very clean here, RVP. Going to be cleaner as they're just executing Liquid right now. Every time the crosshair is perfectly placed for the heads, they're not missing. They're not mincing their shots. And another clean one right there. So six to three. Either Jame or that five-man swing. Let's see how this one goes down. Fallen's there to swing out to help. Util will fly over. A run boost, perhaps. Oh, and there goes Jane, but it is only the one. There's the Fallen trade. Shot. And that was exactly what they planned to. Converting Fallen's frag. He doesn't catch Sanji across, but that's not the bomb. And he seems to know it. One more across now. Buster does get it there. No one can contest. It should be a plant. 20 seconds. They're still threatening here, VP. It's not over just yet. Both in the site, they have been hitting absolutely everything. Oh, and Sanji's found another one onto Grim. Not a 2v4. Oh, they don't oh it's shaping up. It's going to be Stewie and Naf. Sanji's got too many targets. One from either side, and they do weather the storm. Liquid finally put one on the board. He has the AWP, but it's, this would have to be miraculous. Try the same trick. Oh, and they do line up. Oh, but they spread. Missed shots, and VP find the two necessary frags. It's only Grim and Fallen now. From behind, perhaps kick it. Caught unawares, but there's already support in tunnels in Jame. And just like that, Virtus Pro, another spotless round. How many is that? It seems like every round they've won, they've had, as you said, four, if not five, alive. Yeah, out of these last three of rounds, I think it's the, the last six that we're talking about here. Fallen will grab another there one. But uh, all in all, they, they've had five of those rounds with four players survive, uh, and one of those rounds with, with everybody survive. So let's see how badly they want to throw resources here at Fallen. They can chase. They have the bank to do so. Fallen's grabbed another. This really isn't hurting VP by any means. If they rip this AWP out of Fallen's hands, they're going to continue to throw bodies at him. And Fallen is just absolutely wrecking him. Give it to him. He has survived. Fallen will bring the AWP into the next. He refuses to surrender his arms. Go down quietly. Fallen completely isolated. He won't be able to support this, this split. An early peek from Stewie. He does pull the trigger. Takes down Kicker as he falls. They're swinging in. Naf multiple targets to find. Positioning was good, but couldn't find another chance. Three on three, it's a tough site to retake, and Grim has given him a way in. By having tunnels, it's no longer a guarantee. They know there's one close, and he's burning. Loses a significant amount of health, force forwards. Time's on Liquid's side as well. Those beeps are practically in slow motion. Elish has util, a single flash to get them in. And in goes Fallen. Perfect timing, he tries to no-scope. Sanji's done enough. Time ticking, James hit another, Jane tucks in. Looking for the no-scope, I think that's enough. Elish, 10 second defuse. Gonna be close. Plenty of time, what am I talking about right there? Liquid get their fifth. Sanji taking two points of damage just there and they're continuing forward. Enough. It's not easy to pull this one off. Holding down the trigger, and it's a double, nearly three. Yakinda so low after that exchange with Naf. He's done significant damage. He's made it more than winnable. Kick it. Throws the AWP to the low Yakinda, given the responsibility of tons. Lots of nades as well. We could see a smoke tons. That's going to isolate Yakinda completely out of this exchange. Just to kick it then. Flashes are good, space being taken, one swings in. Another perfect flash, Elise gets the first, it's just Yakinda. And neat and tidy. A sixth put on the board for Team Liquid, closing it out with some style. And that's what they needed, North America versus Virtus Pro. Deployed as they start to walk up, they can have four CTs up on short here, Chad. Sandy to delay, if he could just find one, it's gonna get awkward from short. Across they go, now the flames leave. Yet to see bloodshed. Bomb to be planted. There's still that 
wave of blue on short now reveals itself. Elige has got some unfavorable jewels, really, with the Glock. And oh, the flashes, though. Oh, the flashes set them up for success. Goosh, James got one HP. And oh. finished off neat and tidy. Elige has quite the pistol. Three to his name. The other ones there ready to shoot again. So this is going to be so difficult to get past. Oh, and Elige goes down as he jumps. That is so punishing. Not another one. Actual damage from Yakinder into Grim. Into his head. Three frags on the scout. No armor, no problem. Liquid, a spotless pistol. Met by your kinder in the second. Smokes on the cross. Sui has to be the hero. Naf alongside for support, long range at this point. He has an AK-47, but he doesn't have the health. It's one bullet. Any of those through the smoke could have taken him down. Oh, now flames. flames. Okay, These are, you'll have heard that. They'll know he's close. Buster's looking at the smoke jump up. Stewie is across, Naf. Now with an AK-47, can do damage. Kick it. He's found on Elevator, expecting to swing, and Naf, he finds them both. Just one more on the site to save Liquid, oh, and he's found it as well. Bales Team Liquid out of trouble. What a sensation he is. But if they feign this short piece, Jane might drop back. This all comes down to timing. Stubborn, and he evades the flash nicely. Bodies dropped, dropping his util now towards that short presence. He's doing both jobs simultaneously. Good flash. They don't check it. No punish. Stewie with one. Pressure Tries to one way. Don't forget Elise is low. Anything he finds, no, not to beat. Sanji punishes and only two members left as they cross in. Looking great for Vertus Pro's 10th there. Yakinder in support. Spray is golden from Naf, but it would have to be more than flanking. that. Oh, no time on that with the AUG. Stewie heading towards the three CTs on long. And he's on his own. He isn't. He's out, and he's making a lot of noise. He's actually managed to inflict some damage as well. Your kinder gets the pressure. You're going mid to be on this. Yeah, and they're holding it. They're not ready for it, though. And now the smoke blooms. Kick it. Buster, spring to action, spring to life, oh, and fill the them. feed. No one left. Stewie caught through the doors as well. That is a quick solution to the problem. Jane goes looking, and he finds its target. Stewie sent to another grave. Frustration mounting. Early casualty, liquid to overcome it. Passive stance, but not for your kinder. He's gone forward in front of the smoke, trying to hold them at bay. Jane catches flashes, but did land some lead. Elise is dead. Two frags to James name, misses his shot. Now they're across, or are they? Can't hit through the box, but kick it can. Fallen is exposed and so much damage. With just 10 HP left, he's a sitting target. Three coming in from long. Fallen needs a headshot now. It's not to be Grim asked to clutch. Good reaction onto one, but that'll be it. VP, very comfortable retake. No sweat on the brow. Concede the site and retake together. They've kept one flash for this. It's on Naf. Could be the clutch flash, something they need because VP have a lot. Oh, Stewie goes looking and there's no trade available. Yakinda just waits, bides his time and strikes. Nade towards Naf's corner. Oh, it's perfect. On his nose, Yakinda's already found a second. Grim's there, the flash is out from Naf and it slows them down, but it's not enough. No CTs down yet, and there's still plenty of time on that clock. V VP. They're not sure yet. Getting a bit awkward now. Five second defuse, and there you have it. One's on it, and Sanji can't really be knocked off it. Look at the bodyguards. Wow, they make that retake. Albeit right down to the final closing 10 seconds, they do manage to make it look pretty damn intentional. There's no sound cues, nothing they need to react to right now, holding onto a lot of smokes, a lot of Molotovs. They can use these defensively. And there's another one. His timing, impeccable today. We'll get into A for almost free here though, Alex. You can see all the utility coming out now. Nobody able to stop this, but we saw VP play retake against the Eco. They're happy to do it again. You have Sanji's to be. just closed the door on long. They're all isolated towards short and sight. You have to be worried about short. And okay, Naf has turned his attention to it. So a chance to be the hero once again. Oh, he's hearing a lot of steps. Multiple targets. He needs a few here, Naf. He's got it in Molotov. He's trying to focus on multiple targets. That's the swing and he does adjust nicely into Sanji Stewie though. Quiet so far. Needs a double on short to make this round oh, reality. And Buster, Buster just blows on. his head off. Fallen. Pressure from every side, every angle. The bullets just keep coming, as does Kick it. Looking for the defuse. Buster's there in time. We see our 15th. Virtus Pro are just running towards the finish line here. 
Smokes. Oh, and Yukinda. Another frag. Dewey first again. Dewey caught as he mantled the box. A cruel punishment for Stewie. And over the smoke, Fallen's head sticks out like a sore thumb. Yukinda. Two frags to pull Dust 2 into a VP semi final map one. Only Naf, Grim, and a tagged up Liege to keep Liquid's fighting chances. Made no headway in this round whatsoever. They're Nothing. just going straight into what VP won. And they're ready to receive him. Sandy not taking early contact. There's the supporting flashes. Grim sees nobody home and opts to plant. It's not been an issue for VP in the past, and it doesn't seem like it'll be an issue here. Just onto a leash then, and it's clean, it's tidy, it's Vartus Pro, baby. They are here in the semi finals with a statement on Dust 2. Team Liquid 9, Vertus Pro 6. To this one, just going to obscure vision up towards Catwalk, only towards Window as well. And oh, they're able to use that seven seconds just to get themselves close to connect. Stewie has a chance against Buster here, just keeping him busy. Kinder's open the account. He already has caught Grim, and that's the bomb as well. If he gets another, how has he not gone down? So many bullets. No one gone down. Oh, Liege. One on five, 31 points of health. He has found the doorway. But look Buster, at Buster, yeah, Look at this. Let him in. He's coming, B-Boys. Don't worry about it. Clean sheet. And VP just did what Liquid uh, did to them in the first map. I wouldn't say VP or Slouch is on this map by any means. Team Liquid obviously finding some confidence here. About to get mowed down in the underpass. You kinder active, of course. Just left to his own devices. Fallen. That was sharp. That was sharp. If they get another one, this could actually get awkward. And... Buster manages to pull himself out of trouble. Stops Fordham from causing any more. Oh, Elise, I mean, he'd have dreamed of a bomb plant, but Kick actually catches some Glock. He'll get it down. Yep, and Sanji's catching oh, okay. Glock. What is okay, what's going on? Sanji's down. Buster's low. M4 recovered, Buster caught flak earlier. And oh my God, full off. Glock eco. A full eco, and it comes down to Jame. He's got a scout, it's the worst weapon for the job. No kit, it looks like Liquid have done it. And Naf confirms it. What is that turnaround? It all started with the loss of Yakinda. Yeah, but Sanji's going to be able to delay them real nice, actually, on the jiggle here. Should enable at least one rotate. Oh, he doesn't go down, drops it deep. They're Bombs ahead of in it. front, they're going. And James missed his shot. Surely caught in transition. Needs a double from Sanji, and he's delivered. Laying down the law. They can't force off Jame. Everyone from VP. They've got Jame and Sanji online now. Just the one man left. Liquid dissolve as they walk through halls. Sanji's done enough. The rest of formality. And Stewie finished off nicely, but it's Sanji holding them at bay. Jane deals with a double on apps as well. It's going to be a B finish, and there's no one on the B site right now. Bombs up in the apartments. Oh, and Elise is going to be so punishing on the way back through. Oh. Sanji, though. Sanji, such a prime position. It's only Buster on the site. If oh, he can, Buster. It can scream, he's making it difficult. The retake all the more likely with Buster fragging like that. Nav has util, a deep smoke could save the day. He's opting for info, heading into kitchen. What, Fallen's not ready for this? There's two coming and he's oh, down. And he doesn't go down immediately, but he does go down. Nav now demanded to pull off a 1v3. Jame into the kitchen. Nav fly, he reads it, but Jame's <laughs> so ready. And VP equalize. Oh, this is perfect timing from Kicker. He's going to get in and He's destabilize this. as well, yeah. Stewie may not be ready for this. Oh, yeah, again. Caught on the mantle and on ramp aggression. That's important from Grim. Jame doesn't miss. Having to pay the blood price just to enter the site. Flash is great. Yukinda tried to push on. I think he ate a bit too much of that. And Fallen does hold the precipice of the smoke. And oh, just the as he pulls out the bomb. He takes down a liege, another on the list as well. Poor Naf, he's lost his teammates. He's got 30 seconds to not lose this round and Yakinda has flubbed the lines a little bit. Both of them are CT and he tries to take a gamble. Buster swings out. Do you know the luxury? What's he up to? Okay, Stewie's taking space. So much space and at such a quick pace. They're going to be. Buster, he's always finding the double that slows it down. He's already found one, and Elise on the plate, Grim and Naf, both into the site, and Naf's not done either. Bomb down, I think the round might be, though. Wow, that is the fastest we have seen Liquid move. 
And looks like they should be keeping four players alive as well. So a chance for them to stabilize these plants looking good. We'll get that NAF double again through the smoke. Definitely needs that one right there. And yeah, Yakinda, if he gets across, there's a chance for him to do a lot more damage. Waits for the Q, drops it. Fallen's right on the hunt. Sanji has his little gap, but Fallen's got the MAC-10. Drives by and locks down the side. I say locks down. Yakinda smoked off. Oh. Molotov's finding oh. a safe haven. Oh. He can't find anything. The entire carpet of flame. And those double orbs, as we discussed, will not be favorable for this exchange. In fact, Buster's lost his. And James in CT. I don't see any reason Fallen wouldn't chase that down somehow with his MAC-10. Look at them, they're all coming up. Connector, A ramp. Jane, where are you going to hide, mate? Oh, CT, they're coming. Elise has got him booked on default. Survival of the fittest. He oh. takes two with him. But Liquid deny every single weapon. Problems all around him. Single-handedly got mid and A to, to look over. They're going into the stack with the bomb. They're committing into B. Yeah, I mean, it's Deagles. Off angles. One early frag from someone like Kicker can start the ball rolling. The snowball starting an avalanche is only Stewie. Stewie. 1v3 now. They've turned it around on its head into the lion's den. Damage onto Buster. He can hold in. Jame has the AWP posted up. Stewie jiggles back into the vulnerability now. They're not peeking him. They're not giving him an inch. Nothing. They don't have to. You've got a plant, bro. He has found the head, knows James in Kitchen, but it's just too difficult to knock him off his perch and VP get a taste of the success. One way around it, this is cheeky business from Yakinda here. Certainly a safe spot, safe haven. Oh, he eats the flashbang. Someone will be able to work that out and they do. First frag for goes Team Liquid's way. A weird pincer now for Buster. He's tucked in on Tetris, kick it to bait him in. Grim swing and triple, not expecting that. That's at least the first, they equalize. Kicker's managed to find two, but so does Liquid. Keeping it just a one-man advantage. They won't be able to deny this, and the flash is perfect to stop Sanji's spray. Jame on jungle. Elise oh. actually walks into it, but with a missed shot, that might mark the end of this one. Seven now from Liquid. T side, you're happy with that. You would have been happy with six, so good stuff here. Maybe there's some more legs to this one. Jame is still close A ramp as well. He's been posted up with his AWP the entire time. So he's set up for some success in the connector area, but in losing a liege is a big loss. Talking of finding the gaps in VP's defenses, Sanji often pulls this one off. It's a very, very passive crossfire, but it's got everything covered. You can't blame him. He heard him. Oh, and it was a crucial frag. He's found Sanji, maybe. That pulls James back into the site and the back is turned. James not looking. Oh, not ready, not ready either, and that's the bomb. James can just w win this one by staring at the ramp. And Stewie is his next victim. Nav would have to find some insane way in. We see seven for VP. And it makes sense to put all their schmeckles into that round when you convert like that. So Liquid, it'll, they'll have to do it the old fashioned way. Bullets, flashbangs, they're oh, advancing. Nav jumps evasively and he does survive, lives to tell the tale, they can double swing now. It's an AWP, Jay manages to isolate the two 1v1s and he wants more. Hunting for Nav fly, the flash doesn't stop him. He knows where you are now and Nav plays it to perfection. Looks like Liquid will be finishing this one with that final eighth, winning out on their T half. Buster's locked in here, look at this, Elise close, he's even pushing forward, CT. Fallen wants some info as well. They know Buster has to rotate into this and time is the enemy now. You turn the corner into not only a potential AWP, it's Fallen tucked in on the tight line. No way in, no hope for Buster. Oh. And there you have it, Liquid 8, VP7, map two. The semi-final's got some kick in it yet. Okay, so James wants to punish the rotate. Might even come laid up short here, but they need to get that bomb down open first. Two players to get through, Stewie and Grim on the site, Nafra heading over as well. Still no commitment right now from VP. What Do they earth? show the bomb again? Oh, well, B's closed. See you later, James. It has to be A. Set off, and they're coming back to A, so kick it like a yo-yo. Doesn't oh, know where to go. No, neither did Stewie, though, and Sanji, late arrival from Palace, does hit the only shot he had to. Where do they plant? It's default. Yeah, kick it can't do that with Naf there. Grim's there as well. The whole party, the whole brigade, Elige, taps on one head. Sanji and kick it up against it. The bomb is down, trying to hold these swinging CTs. It's too good. And Grim, he gets the job done. Liquid, another pistol in the bag.
Oh, and Elise just over the edge of the smoke. He won't be able to adjust. That's Yakinda shut down. A big frag to find, and there's a second on the cards. Jame deleted. Tetris has been taken right now, so still pressure on the A bomb site. Liege might get caught with his pants down, and that's it. He does, and now it's difficult for the remaining CT player. Looks like Grim and Stu have done enough elsewhere. Mid clear. Bomb was left ramp. Buster's now left alone. He hears him. Naf joining CT, and that's the timing Stu he chooses. He will take an AK 47 for his troubles, and Liquid will take a tenth. Lots of eyes will be on Stu if they get past the Liege. Yeah, and it's Stewie kind of on an island as well. Fallen's rotates on CTs miles away. Timing and great adjustment. Elise is burning. He's fighting to get out. Stands and fights. Calls more mid. Stewie under some serious scrutiny. Oh, what a shot. Takes down Sanji. Buster to trade. And the bomb now down. Fallen has to break through James' line. Buster tucks in, keeps himself passive. James posted up. There is a flash on Grim. Oh, he what a shot! A shot! My God, one across already. Fallen, closing into Buster. Easy shot for him. Wow. Now James to clutch up. Fallen just needs to force this fight up against the Orpa. He's running out of time. VP looking good. He needs to hit the spray now. Time is of the essence to James. No issue, no scope. Twenty and seven. <laughs> they have kicked your ball over the fence. Oh, up mid. Yakinda. Oh, he was looking for him. Oh. Yeah, on the recovery mission. This is a wasted round. I, I don't understand why the buy was so late from falling out of spawn. Was the call not made? Was it just a Hail Mary play? Was it an accidental purchase? I don't know what's happened, but either way, this is great for VP. Oh, but the bomb. Maybe Grim's got something left. If Sanji goes down to Nav, we've got a game here. We've got a round, especially oh. now James gone down. Out from Palace. It's on to Nav and a one on one. Yakinda's already found three. Now, the question of the bomb is on ramp. So, Naf piecing this one together. Yakinda knife out at this point. Does Yakinda go hunting? 12 seconds. He has to focus on the plant. Just getting across this sight line. Naf's played it well. Heard the steps. Now what? Doesn't want to tell him where he is just yet. Flash for his peak. Naf has not told him anything. And now, in transition, Yakinda makes it four, makes it a clutch, and pulls VP closer to finishing this one in two. Retake its control. It's unlikely to be dry. Is he just going to walk in? Tight line. Hell, Jame, oh, what is that kind Jame. of peak? Jame, the entry fragger with his AWP. No less opening up the account for VP. Elise tries to stand the delivery. He's done well to get away. But Jame lining up another three so far. Two more remain. Team Liquid world shakes as Jame jumps down. Really going to run this one down to the wire. Lots of rounds of Counter-Strike still to be played. Lost bonus about to trickle into that bank account. You can see they're going up around that 2,900 mark, just under the 3K. And this is James opening. Like, uh, of course Fallen's not going to be ready for something like this. You're not expecting an Orpa to fall out of the sky like that. And they have to play aggressive in those kind of maneuvers because of the lack of utility. And James just done the perfect play, ready and rowing for that to go. So, yeah. And with the smoke on ramp, Fallen can be responsible for all oh, the angle. The the angles. This is great. In comes VP. Stewie unloads his mag. And what a spray! Three frags from Stewie 2K. And Jame thrust into what was a 1v4. A quick action into Grim. And a oh! quick one into Stewie. Maybe Jame's not done. He jumps, evades the shot. Naf has to tuck back in. The bomb is on B. But it is just within his grasp if he can find a frag onto Fallen. No, it's denied and Stewie's heroics will convert. Liquid will take the 12th and we have a competitive mirage after all. Oh, it looks fast. Stewie to be tested again then. Naf alongside. Incendiaries look good. Flashes are great. And look at that, Stewie's already gone. The MAC-10 so fast, so fierce. Quick trades. Oh, and oh. Yakinda, how does he get a second? Elijah's feet don't even touch the ground as he leaps through the smoke. Just like that, VP turn up the pace and turn up the heat. And Yakinda is already hunting. They understand they are locked in towards Palace. Jame has T spawn, Yakinda over towards CT. It's only a matter of time until Fallen and Grim give these up. Damn, that KD. James hunting for his 27th here and Grim is there. Bates oh. the shot, Grim. He'll take the upgrade, thank you very much. Drop that util and 
surely the only way back in would be through the other's entrance. That's where your kind is headed. When this bomb explodes, pushing oh, through these smoke. smokes, yeah, they might find the timing on this. Oh, Lord, the pressure's not done. A tea smoke just to let them know he's coming. Walking up on it. Timing jumps through the smoke as the bomb explodes and Fallen did not hear a thing. They Rims both lose well. it. They lose everything. No resistance middle whatsoever. Look They've... how quickly he's up, dude. He's going to go through this. He's oh, going to take the gap. Oh, yeah, he's taken such a huge amount of space and this passive hold. There is no one home. Fallen's already gone. Grim doesn't have a chance. And just like that, the rest are on B, twiddling their thumbs. Elige just pre-aimed. Sanji's holding a perfect angle around the smoke. There is no way in for Team Liquid here, Chad. There was not a single point of resistance on mid, and Yakinda took every inch he was given, and he's going How for fast more. was that? That's who he's even heard right now. He was oh. on top of the stairs at a minute 29. My lord. Oh. And Yakinda's just going to take everything. Deny it all. He wants the world to know not only who he is, but what the Virtus Pro, Virtus Plow, new breed can do grand finals one round away what a huge turn up of the pace and all of these pace changes have been so uh so perfectly timed so punishing make you pay for it is he gonna try it again or famous's one mp9 working with absolutely nothing look here. at him go gotta go fast oh what <laughs> <laughs> through the wall through the smoke james has taken down fall and surely not no way for him to voice concerns about this one fall is just gonna have to sit and watch He doesn't have the weapon. He doesn't have the util. He has nothing going for him on this one. He's going to be calling for the backup now. They're in the site. Multiple targets. They spotted him out. A wide swing in Yakinda. Adding another one to his list. He wants 30 before he's done in this game. Finally silenced. The only the one though. Needed a multi-kill. Ever the absent multi-kill. Both from short. Jame looking for info. Tags up another. Doesn't miss a beat. Doesn't miss a shot. Closing the gap a little bit. Kick it onto the first. It's all onto Grim. We'll already find the first two. VP both low, just both need low. to silence him. He's got plenty of time. Advancing onto James' position. He's Grim. isolated it. Can he really? Oh, oh Sanji, the heartbreaker. And Virtus Pro, they're off to the grand finals. What a performance. Consistency. And a new name to remember.